You people have failed me. No one commented on my last video. And guys, that's a real tearjerker right here. Really tugs at the heartstrings. See, I'm crying. Okay. But, very upset with you people. I just can't talk to you people. Just kidding. I love you. Except, you guys, like, broke my heart. Ugh. Okay. Okay. So, since you guys didn't give me any topics, I'll just have to make something up. Okay, so on Friday, we had to do dance etiquette, where these old people came in and were all like, Okay guys, we're going to teach you how to dance. We're like, we hate you people. We don't want to learn how to. Because it's really awkward. Because they pair you up with all these random people in your grade. Like, mmm. -hmm. And they're like, okay, now the man has to offer the lady his elbow. And you're like, really? Are you really making us do this? We're only in seventh grade, people. Seven! And so then they're all like, okay, now we're gonna dance. And of course, me being as tall as I am, I get paired up with one of the shortest people in my grade. Of course, right? And we have to do this awkward move where the guy has to like lift his arm up like so and the girl has to spin underneath him. But of course, my partner couldn't lift his arm up that high. So he had to jump. I had to squat. It's terrible. Just an awful day. And then later that day, I went skiing with my friends, right? And then this girl comes. Her name's Jessie. Small one. And my other friend is like, oh yeah, I know her. I'm, I'm real good friends with her. So I was like, okay, how about we go talk to her? She's like in first grade, right? And so we go up to her and we're like, hey. And she's like, hi. And she's like, ah. And Jessie is like freaking out. She's like, you're going to ski with us. My friend was, right? And I'm like, sure. I want a first grader ski with us, whatever. And so she started following us around, right? And then it's just terrible. And well, it wasn't terrible. I had fun with her at first, but then she started getting really annoying and she went and put the bar down on the ski lift. I was like, really? You're a small kid. You're going to fall off. We have to put the bar down. So terrible. And then it was like the second triathlon we were going on and we were going down and then she fell and she couldn't get back up and we were like in the middle of the mountain and we we're like of course this is what happens when i try to be nice to someone and so she couldn't get back up and we were trying to lift her and she like wouldn't like work with us and we're like seriously you have to try to stand up and she's like i can't <laughs> and we're like well we can't help you up and then i was and then i was to my friend i was like we should just book it down and leave her and apparently she heard me and she started like crying. I was like, great, of course, wonderful. And so we finally got her up after like 10 terrible minutes. And of course by that time we had to leave because our bus was coming. And so I had to call her mom and be all like, I have your daughter, can you take her? Well, I already met her mom earlier because she bought me cotton candy because apparently she thinks I'm amazing. And terrible right and so we meet her at the bottom and she's like thank you so much for watching my daughter i'm like great four hours no problem and so she gives me a five dollar bill for four hours of pretty much babysitting it's Ugh. okay so it's just a little update on my fail life and then i went to my ba okay and then i went to this basketball game at the high school near me and my friend was playing with this hair tie, right? Like, so, right there. And she was playing with it because she was trying to shoot it into the trash can. But of course, she misses knowing her, and she shoots it, and it goes flying out onto the basketball court. And it was there for, like, the whole game, and people were, like, slipping on it. We are like, seriously? This is what happened? Terrible. And it's just... Yeah... And so we were like watching it the whole game and people were like avoiding him. We're like, <sighs> life is terrible. And just wasn't a good day, guys. 
was like a piece of spaghetti drowning out your sorrow. I don't know what kind of metaphor or similar or whatever that was, but it just wasn't good. It wasn't a good day. And yeah. So comment. Give me topics this time so I don't have to do another one of these fail things telling you about my life. Because honestly, who cares about that? Except me. No, it's just my life. No one wants to hear about that. It's boring. Actually, my life is pretty exciting. But you know what? I'm not getting into detail. So give me ideas and I will see you guys later. Bye.